you know, not just the patients, but maybe even the doctors or, or even your casual um, acquaintances? Oh yeah. It's all about attitude and mindset because I deal all my life with negative people, but normally what happens is negative people attract negative people. Sometimes they cross road with positive people, but what happens to the positive people, if they're smart, they won't stick around to try to change them, which I don't do that. What I do, if I'm in an event and there are a bunch of negative people, normally if I talk to them and they see that they drag, either drag you down or build you up, right? So I'll find another negative person and introduce to themselves and let them alone. You know, that's what I do. But the reason I do that because it's contagious, like, like anything else. You cannot change them. They are not ready to change, so what's going to do is going to drag you down. So either let them go or get dragged. So to me, I like to be with positive people, people who lift you up, uh, have common mindset or common philosophies uh, and not always whining about things, it's not working and so on. And I think people need to, to know how to let negativity go away. You can completely eliminate, eliminate it, but you can create strategies. And the strategies we're going to teach here is really unique because we're going to teach them how do you identify a negative person you have to identify uh, negative employees, you know, how do you identify them? I mean, if they're going to work with you, they can ruin your office. You don't even know who is answering your phone can screw up your business. You need to know who is your assistant who talks with your patients. If they're negative, you know you're not going to have cases. So the environment that you create, you have to have positivity. Not just one person needs to be positive, but the whole team. So you, know, you will learn what questions to ask, how to engage with groups and people. And that's the beauty about success academy that the people that's going to show up here are the people that are positive like-minded people that want to change so it's going to be a nice common cooperative uh, kind of culture of changes it's going to be uh, accountability basically with people that are going to interact with each other so it's going to be very fun to find out how to deal with negative people you cannot eliminate it but you know how to deal with it so that's that's what we're going to share very nice. Yeah, I totally agree with that. In one of my programs that I teach, I actually talk about cleaning up your friends list. Yes.